we'll see the fifth question in that the first bit is 26 times negative 48 plus negative 48 times negative 36 here we'll use the distributive law of multiplication over addition which means for any integers a b and c a times of b plus c gives a times of b plus a times of c here we can see that the integers are a corresponds to minus 48 and b corresponds to 26 and c corresponds to negative 36 therefore 26 times of negative 48 plus negative 48 times of negative 36 can be written as negative 48 times 26 minus 36 this gives negative 48 times negative 10 48 into 10 gives 480 as the signs are similar get positive sign therefore the answer is plus 480 we'll see the second bit that is 8 multiplied by 53 multiplied by negative 125 here we use the associative property of multiplication we'll first group the first two integers that is 8 into 53 grouped together multiplied by negative 125 that gives 8 into 53 gives 424 and we are left with negative 125 424 into 125 gives 53,000 as the signs are different we get negative sign therefore the answer is negative 53,000 we'll see the next bit that is 15 times of negative 25 multiplied by negative 4 times negative 10 here we'll group the first two integers and the last two integers that gives 15 times negative 25 grouped together multiplied by negative 4 times negative 10 grouped together 15 into 25 gives 375 as the signs are different we get a negative sign and we are left with negative 4 times negative 10 4 into 10 gives 40 as the signs are similar we get plus 40 therefore negative 375 into plus 40 375 into 40 gives 15,000 as the signs are different we get a negative sign therefore the answer is negative 15,000 we'll see the next problem that is negative 41 times of 102 this can be written as negative 41 times of 102 can be written as 100 plus 2 from the distributive law of multiplication over addition for any integers a b and c a times of b plus c gives a times of b plus a times of c here a can be taken out as a common term which is nothing but negative 41 100 and 2 correspond to the integers b and c therefore it can be written as negative 41 times of 100 plus negative 41 times of 2 41 into 100 gives 4100 as the signs are different we get minus and we are left with negative 41 times of 2 41 into 2 gives 82 as the signs are different we get a negative sign therefore negative 41,000 plus of negative 82 this gives negative 4,182 therefore the answer is minus 4,182 we will see the next bit that is 625 multiplied by negative 35 plus negative 625 multiplied by 65 this can be written as 625 times negative 35 plus we will take the negative sign as common that gives negative 1 multiplied by 625 times 65 from the distributive law of multiplication over addition we for any integers a b and c a times of b plus c gives a times of b plus a times of c 
here 625 can be taken outside as a common term which is nothing but a and negative 35 and here as negative 1 is common it can be multiplied with 65 gives negative 65 this is nothing but c this can be written as 625 into negative 35 plus 625 into negative 65 625 into 35 gives from the distributive law of multiplication over addition we can bring out the common term that is 625 outside and we can add negative 35 plus negative 65 this gives 625 into negative 35 plus negative 65 gives negative 100 that is equals to 625 into 100 gives 62500 as the signs are different we get a negative sign therefore the answer is negative 62500 we will see the next problem that is 7 times of 50 minus 2 from the distributive law of multiplication over subtraction for any integers a b and c a times of b minus c gives a times of b minus a times of c here 7 is common and it corresponds to a 50 corresponds to b and 2 corresponds to c therefore this can be written as 7 into 50 minus 7 into 2 7 into 50 gives 350 and 7 into 2 gives 40 therefore we are having 350 minus 14 that gives plus 330 therefore the answer is plus 336 we'll see the next problem that is negative 17 multiplied by negative 20 this can be written as negative 17 times of negative 30 plus 1 from the distributive law of multiplication over addition for any integers a b and c a times of b plus c gives a times of b plus a times of c here negative 17 is common term it is taken outside and it corresponds to a negative 30 corresponds to b and 1 corresponds to c therefore this can be written as negative 17 times of negative 30 plus negative 17 times of 1 negative 17 times of negative 30 gives plus 510 and we are left with negative 17 times of 1 is negative 17 therefore pi 10 minus 17 gives plus 493 therefore the answer is plus 493 we'll see the next problem that is negative 57 times of negative 19 plus 57 this can be written as negative 57 multiplied by negative 19 and here negative 1 can be taken common that means negative 1 multiplied by negative 57 from the distributive law of multiplication over subtraction for any integers a b and c a times of b minus c gives a times of b minus a times of c here negative 57 can be taken as a common term outside and it corresponds to a and negative 19 corresponds to b negative 1 corresponds to c therefore this can be written as negative 57 times of minus 19 minus 1 that is equals to negative 57 times of negative 20 57 into 20 gives 1140 as the signs are similar we get a positive sign therefore the answer is plus 1140